Hey there, everyone, this is Aokao playing Super Mario Galaxy, and I mean, okay, so what's on the menu for the rest of this series? You do have a copy. I feel like I should do a copy just in case, because I am going to be, okay, saving, all right, that's very exciting. Then we get a second toad head, that is not what I thought was going to happen. Anyway, yeah, so hey there everyone, it's Cal playing Mario Galaxy. Alright, so, okay. Basically, thank you for just putting <laughs> the, the purple comet there, like, straight up, considering it's the only thing that I have left for progress. So what I hope happens is that I do that, and then whatever happens that summons Luigi happens, and then, um, and then we're done. And then I can read the last story from Rosalina. Finally, catching up with story time. And there we go. We will have my computer going br 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 for a hot second, getting up here. But then, hopefully, then we will be done. You know, with Mario Mario Galaxy. However, we will not be done done because so. Well, I, so yeah, like we will be got, done with my playthrough, but then in the following days, I'm going to be downloading a save from GameFAX, and we will be playing as Luigi. Check out the stars that are unique to him or transformed to him. Basically, the cosmic races, and that's about it. And then we're going to do the final, final star that unlocks once you get 204 star red hot purple coins. Uh, that's enough talking about things are gonna be. Yeah, I don't know how long. Oh, it's just, uh, here's the level. Here's the coins. Get all of them. All right, fair enough. I can do that. Yeah, like, I don't... It's basically like Freeze Flame. This is the mirror to Freeze Flame, isn't it? It's just, I feel like a lot better at hiding it. All right, so yeah. So I don't know how long that Luigi pose game is gonna take. Like, it could take anywhere between two and five videos, honestly, but we'll see what happens when it happens, uh, but I thought it'd be nice to just put it all out there, my plans, so everyone knows what to expect. We are almost definitely ending before episode 60, though, so manage to... You're just, like, right there in the lava, or in the lava, over the lava, so you're supposed to, like, do something like that. Yeah, that is exactly what you're supposed to do, something like that. Oh, there's another scary couple there. All right, we are going to be returning there. Got hair on my teeth somehow in my mouth. I don't know how it got there. Ugh. All right, so. I'm glad to be here. Whoa. Yeah, okay. All right. Whoa, geez. Uh, be careful. Mario, calm down. This is not the time for that, all right? Do one-ups heal you in this game? I don't think there's any 3D Mario where one-ups heal you, so I don't know where I got that idea. I'm gonna do it anyways, just in case. Alright, so I'm at 29, which is a weird number, but uh, I'm not... Look, if I'm missing a coin somewhere, I lost my big mushroom because I'm kind of careless. What a thought. Alright, gotta wait for that to drop, then I'm gonna go like, uh, and get that, but we need to immediately do that again because... There's you guys right here. Oh, cameras being melted down as we speak. Good night, Lakitu. All right, so. Um, all right, is there any on those platforms? Man. Computer's like, look, look, look. I'm like, no, not look, look. This is not a time for looking. All right, oh wow, you are like all right in. You got like deep fry Mario here. And that happens again on the other side. Okay. Right. I can just get this though real quick. Then hop here. Oh geez, there's like a line of them. Alright, restore balance. Here we go. Doing some physics. Big hop. Alright, so oh geez. Yes. Okay. This is neat. Like this is a good way, I think, to repurpose these little floors. I like that. Now, I saw that we're going through a loop through this landmass, so I'm not gonna freak out about the things I'm leaving, like, over yonder, over there, quite yet. Because we're gonna be going down the volcano, it looks like. Alright, just got that ring, and 
that does that ring out? We got, we got. Okay, no, not quite. There we go. Okay, can you not? Maybe you can wall jump off of a long jump. I just timed it bad. Extremely plausible, honestly. All right, so that gets down. Do you think there's gonna be like purple coins down there? Not in the slightest. I don't think. This is not a thinking type of commercial. All right. We just put a bunch here in a row. See, the thing with, like, get all 50, 900, 9,000 points is that the terrain where you do this are very typically not exactly large. All right, so I'm just gonna drop here because you gotta do that and that's how you get these and that's how I get back here. Yeah, I spotted that. I noticed that. Don't worry about it. Oh, we'll shoot! And I'm bad at me. Oh, I need to not die, though. Uh, take note of that. You can help it. Alright, so, just go over here. Yeah, I'm down to two life. My health circle is pulsating right now. It wants attention, but unfortunately, there's just no money here. Get out of here! Hey, here's money. <laughs> Thank you. All right. Oh shoot! No, no, I need to go back. There's a coin inside one of these little cages right here. I saw it. Did I not saw it? I was sure I saw it. I lied. Oh, maybe I saw one of these. All right. Fair enough. I guess. How? Do you, I'm not. I'm not going over that discussion again. What is fair? Doesn't matter. We're playing Mario. It's an illusion either way. All right. So get here get you so it's this little rice pup no my favorite private cereal I got ten left to get nine left to get I'm not sure where to go at this point maybe there's a way to go inside the volcano because that that I've never went there and uh, people were quick to point out to me that Oh, yeah, look at that. That you can actually get looms there for that one guy that you need to feed. So here you go, hot-footed inside a volcano. And we notice that it's this nice little area. Right in the lava. I did not try very hard to survive there. All right, well, um, I'm one coin off. Where could it be? That's a mighty good question. Oh, oh, hey it is. Whoa. Okay, so flip from that platform. God. Uh, Alright, I guess I'll do another loop around then. Yeah. Oh, well, no, 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 no. If I go on top here, how confident am I at getting there with a long jump? I ask and then immediately try. Yeah, there we go. There we go! Okay, where do you appear, Mr. Star Friend? Uh, right on top, like right very close to where I am. Perfect! This is extremely a Mario Galaxy finale. I feel like, I don't know. Um, not the most exciting star, but you know, people like exploring sometimes. I mean, it's fine. Like, it's not what I would have chosen for my climactic 120, but and slot the, the, the thing is the game kind of didn't really give me a choice. I would have done that easier if I could. And yeah, it's bringing me outside. That's meaningful. Red hot purple coin. Galaxy complete. High score of 4 coins. Root out those numbers. Fade out. Asking me to save right now. I'm saving. And there's an ellipses and everything. All right, because that's gonna get down to zero. To another world. Uh, okay, okay, I see. I understand. So it's making me beat the game again. All right. I mean, I don't know if I want to re refilm the entire beating the game. Anyway, Rosa, give me a moment. I need to go and see you in another room. <laughs> Because <laughs> I want to do that before it's too late. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, it's been a while. Do everyone remember what the story's at? Let us begin. Let us begin. Alright. No, yeah. It's, it's been a little bit. 
but here we go. Chapter 8. The Wish. Though usually quite cheery, one day the girl became sad again. Luma drew close and tried to comfort her. Mama, you still have me! And don't be sad because uh, and don't be sad about your mama because she's a part of you. That means she's always close by. It's like me. I love star bits because they right they remind me of my mama. I what are the connotations of that? No, no, the girl said, unable to stop the tears. Oh, look at that face. Alone. Okay, a lonely look flickered across Luma's face, but it was soon replaced by a wide grin. I have an idea! I will transform into a comet, a soaring comet that can carry you all on this journey. All being like, all the Lumas? All the Lumas? Yeah! Oh geez, he just did that. With that, Luma, trailing bands of white, soared high into the sky and just as quickly started to plummet back down. Kaboom! Kablam! The ground shook, and a bright light poured out of the crater that the Luma had created. Now yeah, we can see that very clearly. The bands of light twisted together to form a comet tail. And then Luma emerged, reborn as a comet. Look at all of them. The girl could scarcely believe her eyes. But... How? She kept asking. Our destiny as Lumas is to transform into different things, said a red Luma, who had suddenly appeared. <laughs> Surprise! Stars, comets, planets, we can become all of those things. When I grow up, I want to become a star that makes someone special smile, said a green Luma. And Blue Luma chimed in. That Luma turned into a real cutie of a comet, didn't he? I... I am not equipped to analyze comets in such a way. All of the Lumas together said, No more crying, Mama. Thank you, said the girl in a whisper. I did not whisper because I didn't read ahead. And she pulled the Lumas close and hugged them. From that day on... Star bits no longer fell from the girl's eyes. Whoa, we've been we've been collecting her tears. The comet set forth for the girl's home planet, its long tail blazing proudly behind it. Oh, look at that. It's kind of, wait a sec. There's a ninth chapter all this time. Huh. Had I known. Oh look at that! They're in the kitchen. With what with its many Lumas and telescopes, the comet was quite a sight to behold. The girl and the Lumas were proud to call it home. At a welcoming party for a new Luma, the girl gathered everyone in the kitchen and said in a louder voice than usual, All right, everyone, let's make a cake. A cake sprinkled with star bits. Then we'll be a star cake. The Lumas excitedly began to gather the ingredients. Why are you threatening that Luma like that? As she watched the Lumas scurry about, the girl smiled and thought to herself, This is my family now, and I will stay with them until they're ready to leave the nest. And when they do, I'll see them off with a smile. Because that's what makes a mother happiest. That night, when the girl lay down to sleep, a soft light enveloped her and reminded her of the blue planet she once called home. But it would be nice to return home once every 100 years to nap in my favorite sleeping nook. Very precise, like why 100 years? The comet carrying the Lumas and the girl continued on its journey to this very day. With more family members in Tau than can be counted, it's said that the comet visits the girl's home planet once every hundred years, its proud white tail glittering in the sky. And... Or is it? It feels like the story is kind of ongoing. Feels like maybe we're in it right now. Alright, so there was a, 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 a ninth part. I don't know when that would have been unlocked. I kind of got blindsided. It's my fault, I guess, for assuming. Like, it had... 
it's my fault for assuming. That's what it boils down to. All right, Rosa, I'm done with Rosa. I might not show this whole thing since I I don't know if it's like just beating the game again or what. I guess we'll see. The salient time, the moment. Yeah, let's do that. Go seek out our special one. Uh, have everything happen again. I did it! I beat the game though! Oh, you can press a button to skip the cutscene. The button I press was jump! Fate of the universe! This is a really cool place, but like, not the hardest part in the game, it's... I don't know how I would call this game structure. I feel like it's not necessarily a difficulty curve. Like, it certainly goes more generally harder as it goes. But it's kind of lumpy. It is a lumpy ride, which is not necessarily bad in itself, mind you. Some lumps is good. You don't want just a straight curve. After all. Right, right down the spanner. Whoa, well, I, oh God, I took that bait. <laughs> straight up. I'm being a bit cavalier here, I realize. Like, it just, like... I was certain that I would have killed the bullet dill, but I didn't. Like, I thought you could spin on them, but I guess not. I guess I've always led them into stuff, huh? So where did I get that idea? Uh, uh, whoa, well, uh, okay. Oh, that... I thought I had enough time. Wow, I am just... Okay. Oh, gotta jump a little bit. There you go. Alright. Big ol' camo block. That's kind of funny. Very useful in space. <laughs> camo pattern. Look at that. Just big, proud dad. Just kind of watching his son do his thing. Family is beautiful. That's a message in this game. All right, except you didn't try very hard and did kind of a bad job. Oh boy, all right. And yeah, and then he resets. Oh, but what? He resets on that step, so. Ooh. All right, come on at me, buddy. Counted. Ah. Here, that's right. What's happened with your spikes? On your back. All right, you gotta show it from two angles. Show that violence. I did it. I beat the game again. I just, I just can't stop beating the game. Oh, it's his reflection. I thought it was like a thing inside the star. Like a fetus or something. <laughs> well, now I'm pressing buttons in an attempt to skip through that, and I am not getting any response, so... I might just have to sit through all this again, also. I mean, there could be changes, but I'm gonna be real. If there are, I won't notice them. Just flat out. But I think this is the same. This scene is still so neat. It's so weird looking. I love it. Mario should be like this more often. It's a casual Big Bang, as you do. So apparently, uh, Rosa's science lecture about the birth of stars <laughs> is a lot more accurate than I thought it was, so cool. Like, that's legitimately awesome. I didn't mean it when I, when I asked for a citation. Turns out, no, yeah, she knows what she's talking about.
Hmm? <clears throat> wow, I can't believe they patched in Chris Pratt to play the voice of Mario. Is that Guppy? They brought Guppy. <laughs> okay. Oh yeah, because the honeybee queen is there too. Why are you giving those eyes a Bowser? Like, I could not read her facial expression there. A dead. Well, there's a hurricane. I did it. I be I'm gonna keep saying that forever. So yeah, so now is Luigi a thing? Or do we have to sit through the credits? <sighs> I'll say something at some point. <laughs> Camera programming, honestly, uh, Katsuyasu Ando, good job. Like, considering what the game is, making that camera couldn't have had been easy. Oh yeah, that's a shrinking planet, but if you don't pick any of the coins and make some big old loop, that makes sense. Yeah, they're just casually showing pictures of Luigi now in these scenes. Don't think I noticed kind of late. <laughs> You did Thank it! You so much for playing my game! Oh my god, Mario's just interrupting me all day here. You get like, ba and it then shows like, Luigi can now eat his shoes. I mean, maybe, because they're starting a brand new, like they're just seeking right into like a, right, a brand new thing, yeah. This is the start of the game, right? I think it is. Maybe? Or maybe this is just brand new. Hi, pixelated Rosalina. <laughs> How's it going? So she's right there, above the Earth. All the birds are here. Thank birds you. are from space. <laughs> That's me trying to read her text while also imitating her mouth movement. That was unreasonable of me to criticize that. But I just felt like it. Really, Widow, what is up with all the space seagulls? Space gulls. Yep. In case you somehow did not understand that the comet was her spaceship, now you do. Oh, did she leave that? That's a souvenir? That's a cool little place with very oddly shaped mushrooms. Oh, and the Luma straight. Oh, it's the Luma that lived in Mario's hat, wasn't it? It totally was. Okay, I don't know what that means. Super Luigi Galaxy! Gross. Absolutely disgusting. I can play as Luigi now, and Luigi we will play as! There are five comets that change when you are using Luigi. And so next time, for the next two, three, four days, I don't know how long it's gonna take. But yeah, we got five I'm going to load a save, there are five Luigi Comet that are different when you play as Luigi and when you get 240 stars, you get the final, final, finale, final, which we will save as the final, final, finale, final. Yeah! <laughs>